Hi, I'm Richard Booman. Hi, and I'm Mike Mindy, and we're at PCIM in Nuremberg, Germany, showing off the new Tektronix ISOVIEW system. Our demo here is showing a typical half bridge measurement, measuring the high side VGS and the low side VGS measurement at the same time. One of the new things that ISOVIEW can do with its one million to one call mode rejection from DC to 100 megahertz is we can see the true differential signal writing on top of that large common mode signal and give you that accurate measurement to let you reveal things you couldn't see before. All right, so some of the unique features of the ISOVIEW system is that it's a completely opt optically isolated sensor head. <clears throat> so there's an optical cable, optical fiber cable. There's five fibers in this that carry power, communication, and signal up to the sensor head. So the sensor head is, is floating. It's completely galvanically isolated from the rest of the world. So this sensor head will float at up to 2,000 volts. Um, we have a, a, the common mode loading on your, on your device under test is only two picofarads. We have a, a tripod system here for holding the system up off the, the uh, ground plane. Um, what else can we say? And we do is we provide an electrical connection down to the deck. One of the goals of the ISVU system was maintain that signal integrity down to the differential signal. Re eliminate the EMI effects, right? And my traditional pros with those wires hanging out all over your circuit picks up all the other garbage around it. ISOVIEW shields all the way down to the test point, gives you the accurate differential measurement. I can, I can be confident in the measurement. Behind us is a screen, oops, <laughs> behind us is a, is a comparison. The purple trace here is what industry was seeing before, traditional probing. The yellow trace shows the new ISOVIEW system. This was actually done on a reference circuit from a customer with EGAN devices. This is not a tectronic circuit. They were not aware of the resonance and the plateaus in, and the, in their circuit and all the parasitics in their circuit until we could re reveal it with the ICVU system. Before they were seeing this, they didn't know what was real and what wasn't. They were fixing things that weren't there and due to the measurement system. With a DC to one gigahertz measurement system, I can see those details, high frequency information, and just optimize my design. Pick the right devices, tune my circuit board layout to eliminate these devices and improve the efficiency of my performance of my circuit. Is, 